terutama yang PKN mga function homework mga word problem so up to 4 20 pesos for the first 5 kilometers of travel and 0.75 cents for each additional kilometer over the proposed fare so gusto nila find the fare function f of x where x represents the number of kilometers um, traveled. So, ito yung medyo tricky ito kasi sinabi nila na yung x represents the number of kilometers traveled. Na, which is include the 5 kilometers, yung 5 first kilometers. At nag-charge sila ng 20. So, and each kilometer is 0.75. So, we have to so so, 0 0.75 times 5 kilometer is um, 3 point something, 3.75. So, we subtract, subtract natin yung initial char, yung initial fare na 20 pesos minus um, yung 5 kilometers na 0.75 is 3.75 and this will give us 16.25 pesos kasi yung x ito na yung total number of travel so kailangan natin isubtract yun so yung ating function f of x is equal to ito na 16.25 pesos now i plus natin yung x na yung x is the um, number number of kilometers traveled so and each kilometer traveled is equal to 0 0.75 pesos so 0 0.75 times natin yung x so ito na yung ating function answer to this so um tapos next problem how much is the proposed fare for distance of 3 kilometers? So, since ito ay 20 pesos yung charge within first 5 kilometers. So, yung 3 kilometers is less than 5 kilometers. So, yung charge sa kanya ay yung initial charge which is 20 pesos. So, 20 pesos is ang kanyang pamasahe tapos find the proposed fare distance of 55 kilometers so ito na yung so, mayroon na tayong function dito f of x is equal to this so i-substitute natin yung 50, 55 kilometers sa mga x so f of 55 is equal to 16.25 pesos plus 0.75 times 55 kilometers so this is equal to 16.25 plus point um so we have um 55 times 75 so um 25 25 26 27 and then 35 carry 3 35 36 37 38 so 5 12 carry 1 10, 11 carry 1 4 so 41.25 41.25 so if we add this we get a 57 57 point so ito yung kanyang pamasahe 57.50 so um and next so next problem the cost of producing x tools by a bng corporation is given by the function c of x is equal to 1 2 times x plus 5500 pesos how much is 100 tools so ito na replace lang natin ito c of 100 is equal to 1, 2, times 100, plus 5,500.
That's good. So, multiply lang natin ito. It's equal to 1, 2 times 100 plus 5, 5. So, this is equal to 125. That's good. So, ito na yung kanyang sagot. So, 11, then number 12. Mark charges 100 peso for an encoding work. In addition, he charges 5 pesos per page per page of printed out. So, ito yung kanyang tanong. Find a function of f of x where x represents the number of pages of printed output. So, f of x is equal to so, charge niya yung kanyang encode is 100 plus yung the number of printed output. So, 5 pesos times the number of printed output. So, 100, f of x is equal to 100 plus 5 times x. So, how much will Mark charge, charge for 55 page encoding and encoding and printing work. So, mayroon na tayong function dito. So, f of 55 is equal to 100 plus 5 times x is 55. So, it's equal to 100 plus 55 times 5, which is equal to 25, 25, 26, 27, plus 275 is equal to 100 plus 275 is 375 pesos. So, ito yung kanyang sagot. How many pages, how many pages were printed if Mark received a payment of 600. So, kapag meron siyang na-receive na 600 pesos, ito na yung total na pinayara ng customer. So, 600 is equal to 100 plus 5x. So, we have to find x. So, i-minus natin ito ng 100 minus 100. So, 500 is equal to 5x. So, continue natin dito. So, 500 is equal to 5x. So, divide natin ito ng 5. Divide natin ito ng 5. x is equal to 100. So, 100 pages ang, ang pinaprint at pinaencode ng customer. So, last question. If Mark offers a promo to loyal customer that the first 20 pages of the printed output will be free free of charge then how much will he charge to a loyal customer who printed 70 pages of output so ito na yung at, ito pa rin yung ating function na gagamitin so ngayon gusto niyang if free yung 20 pages so yung customer nagprint siya ng 70 so f of 70 minus minus na natin yung 20 kasi free yung 20 is equal to 100 plus 5 times 70 minus 20 so f of 70 minus 20 is only 50 so it's equal to 100 plus 5 times 50 so, it's equal to 100 plus 5 times 50 is 250. So, 100 plus 250 is equal to 350. Now, this is in pesos. So, 350, 350 pesos ang babayaran ng kanyang customer kapag free ang 20 pages. So, and that's the last homework problem.